Hi everybody and welcome to this revision video on the structure of attitudes. This is linked to the social influence topic for stage 2 psychology. Let's get started. So, psychologists define attitudes as a learned tendency to evaluate things in a certain way. We have attitudes to everything, which includes people, objects, issues, events, organisations and so on. These evaluations can be positive, so for example, I like heavy metal music. They can be negative, I hate the Adelaide Crows. They can be neutral, I have not watched anime, so have no evaluation of it. Or they can be ambivalent, so see both positive and negative viewpoints. So I have mixed feelings about the Milgram experiment. The most widely used theories of the structure of attitude is the tricomponent or ABC model of attitudes. Both of these terms are correct. So the tricomponent or ABC model of attitudes is a description of any attitude in terms of three related components. The affective or the A relates to the feelings or the emotions. The behavioural is the actions or behaviour. And the cognitive is the beliefs or the thoughts. Let's look at these in more detail. So looking first at the A of the model, which is affective. This refers to the emotional reactions or feelings an individual has towards an object, person, group, event, or issue. It's based on a judgment which results in a positive response, so liking or favouring something, a negative response, so disliking or hating something, or a neutral response, a lack of interest or concern. Examples of effective components of an attitude or a feeling would be, I like heavy metal music. I hate the Adelaide Crows. I have no interest in reality TV. So again, it relates to the emotions or the feelings. It is also possible, like I said before, to have an ambivalent attitude. So both positive and negative feelings towards something. For example, you may be feeling excited about finishing year 12 and high school, but uncertain about the future, so would prefer to stay. The B in the ABC model refers to the behaviour or actions that we do in response to an object, person, group, event, or issue. Examples of behavioral components of an attitude may be, I listen to heavy metal music every day, or I boo for the Adelaide Crows when they play football. It is also possible for there to be a lack of action, especially when it comes to a negative attitude. So another correct answer for the negative attitude towards the Adelaide Crows would be, I never watch the Adelaide Crows. So it can also be an absence of behavior, that correctly reflects the attitude. Next we have the C, which is cognitive as part of the ABC model. This refers to the beliefs or the thoughts that we have about an object, person, group, event or issue. Examples for cognitive components may be I believe or I think heavy metal is the best music genre or I believe I think that the Adelaide Crows are the worst team in the AFL. It is easy to confuse C and A of this model. So remember, cognitive is the thoughts and feelings, uh, sorry, is the thoughts and beliefs, excuse me, whereas A is the feelings and emotions. Now, some beliefs are based on fact and some are false. So at the moment, as it currently stands, the Adelaide Crows are actually not the worst team in the AFL. They are not at the bottom of the ladder. So me having this belief or this thought is actually not based on fact. However, it still contributes to my negative attitude towards the Adelaide Crows. So let's put it all together. This is a very common and well-structured positive attitude towards, in this case, heavy metal. So my effective is I like heavy metal music because that reflects the emotion. Behavioural. I listen to heavy metal music every day. It reflects the behaviour, obviously. And then cognitive. I think heavy metal music is the best music genre. That's the thought or the belief. A negative attitude towards the Adelaide Crows. An effective may be, I dislike or I hate the Adelaide Crows. The behaviour is, I boo for the Adelaide Crows when I watch them or attend matches. The cognitive is, I believe or think that the Adelaide Crows are the worst team in the AFL. It's important to remember that in order for it to be a completed attitude, all three aspects must be present. So there must be an effective, behavioural and cognitive component. I hope you found this video useful. Any questions as always, let me know. Otherwise, happy revising.